Okay, welcome to another episode of our Guild Wars 1 playthrough of Factions. Um, I'm, I'm essentially ready to move on into the next mission, but something in me just cannot let myself leave the Jade Sea without completing this Friend of the Luxons title track, or at least getting to 100,000. I feel like I'm so close. Uh, so what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to bring back the noob proof farming method there are two bosses there's one over here that we found is a warrior boss uh who has a green shield green item shield drop and then there's another one up here that has a sword and i figure why don't i just farm this lux faction while trying to farm these greens with our noob proof farming method that we used back uh, or to get these daggers way back when. Um, so I'm gonna try and make it happen. We'll see. Either it fails miserably and I just get some Lux Infaction, or I manage to get some green drops plus the Lux Infaction. Either way, it's win win, I feel like. For this one, I'm not, I'm gonna wanna not bring so much AoE. Instead, I'm gonna bring some support. I want some single target DPS. And, okay. Maybe we need a tankier henchman. So the idea is I'm gonna fight the enemies around the boss. Get some faction. Clear the area. And then I'm gonna try and take out his ads. There he is here. Jeffer Painbringer. I need to take out his ads while keeping him alive. And I'm pretty sure I should be able to solo him with this illusion build. It worked on the assassin, so technically, uh, theoretically rather, it should work on him. But you never know. You just, you just never know. I should keep. Yeah, here we go. Need to keep ineptitude. Yeah, it's working so far. Victory token drop. Oh, the dragon festival started. Huh. Alright, I'm gonna need to make a video about that sometime as well. I never really participated in the festivals that much. I was always just like, eh, what's the point? But this is a time for discovery. Might as well just see what's going on do i need to fight these guys they're just fighting each other okay let's let's work on these enemies so i need to keep him alive luckily he's a tank so it should be should be okay it should be relatively easy there he is so don't attack him oh, i should have used my illusionary weakness before just use it now Don't die, buddy. Let's attack this guy. Oh, the Naga's coming up. Um, yeah. Attack the Ritualist. Oh, no. They're coming up. We just aggroed them. Okay, keep them alive. Take out the Naga. I don't know. Move them away. Yeah. Pick up. They're just going straight after this. I, something about the AI, the enemy AI, they go straight for the spirits. Oh, well, I'm, will I be able to do this? Don't attack him. Keep him alive. Operation. Keep Jeffer Painbringer alive. Oh, he's fighting the Naga for us. That's nice. <clears throat> okay. I'm going to send my team way over there. And they're going to fight each other, maybe. Nice, I got a little tank. Can I beat this guy? Oh, we got some... We got some... Uh... He's just running around. Yeah, I need him to attack, actually, for this build to work. Oh, yeah, this is going to work. Absolutely. Attack me, buddy. 
What if I get it on the first try? And... Oh, I didn't get it. Oh, well. Alright, that's one boss. Let's go ahead and go up. That's actually easier than the assassin boss, actually. So this is a 100% one, chance we're going to get this. Come back, guys. Did they not? Oh, they didn't aggro anyone running that way. Alright, so the next one is up here, I think. I wonder if we got faction for this these enemies that were fighting each other i don't think so i think the fighting was too far away from us wow that's good to know that's like a hundred percent chance of success on that guy it's just a matter of running it that shield is as good as ours Oh, they disenchanted my illusion of weakness, huh? Gosh, how many Naga enemies are there? This build is not really great for... I mean, actually, this build should be okay. Decent damage for these enemies. There's a lot of archers and a lot of warriors, so... Not as much damage as the energy surge, though, that's for sure. And my teammates don't really do the most damage. I might, I might change this um, farming to just farming Jeffers, Jeffer, Jeffer. Cause this is just, I mean, ah, I don't know. We'll see how we'll see how this boss goes. If this boss goes well, we'll keep farming it. I really hope we can get the sword. It's nice that we're gonna get, we're definitely gonna get that shield, but. If this sword drop is um, viable, I'll be really happy. Okay, I think it should be over here. Yes? No? There he is. Okay. So let me try and pull him. Should be the same idea. There's just warriors and archers, so just need to avoid attacking him. And then I should be able to solo him easily. Because... Yeah. Oh, Oni. They're trying to mess everything up. Yeah, I definitely need the henchman for this then. He's Oni would own me. Yeah? See what I did there? <laughs> That's so stupid. Okay. Get serious. Oh, we we managed to aggro. Nice, we managed to aggro his his teammates without aggroing him. So this is gonna be easy, also, if we can consistently do that. No, no, no. Stay here, guys. There's one more archer over there. The spirits are actually really good for farming because they can stick around and do some damage while my teammates are like just running away. I don't know. You guys all get out of here. <clears throat> nice. I need to keep channeling up actually. Need that energy. Oh, he stopped attacking right when I used Images of Remorse. Lame.
Oh, the healing signet's gonna cause some problems. I need to make sure I have empathy up all the time. That's a quick recharge. Nice, lucky. Uh, have to do. I think I got it. One more. Empathy damage. Got him. All right, so this is gonna be possible. We got this. Take two. That's pretty decent. We got like, I don't remember what I started with. I feel like I got like 600 faction off of that. Am I overestimating it? At least like 300, 400 faction, I think is what I'm working with here. Always forget to cast Illusion of Weakness first before before the battle starts. And channeling as well. Like, this will be good energy generation here. I don't even really need Distortion, though, honestly. Just like an extra useless skill at this point. Oh, are they fighting? No, they're not. They're fighting each other. Let's try and pull them back a little bit. That Naga group kind of messed things up. Oh, my illusion of weakness is gone. Where's he at? I'm losing him. Did he die already? No. No, don't attack him. Don't attack him. Alright, the Naga came up anyway. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. He's our prisoner. We want him alive. A lot of people think you need to ping your, your henchmen away. But actually, you just need to say, no, 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 no. You just need to talk to them. They listen to you. Their voice activated. Where's he at? Okay. He's fighting. Protection guy. The ritualist is causing problems. Take his energy away. One more warrior. And then you guys can leave. I got this from here. I'll get I'll take it from here, guys. Oh. Actually no no. One more Naga. Jeffers is kind of helping us, though. Okay. Now you guys can leave. Over there. Just watch them fight a little bit. <laughs> I guess they're just going to battle it out. Yeah, we got this, we got this. Oh man, that would have been awesome. This is a pretty fast one. All right, come back guys. Man, the archer attacks just so slow. Why is he attacking so slowly? like stops and uses an ability every two hits empathy is not great against them let me try and avoid the enemies i don't want to have to fight all these guys let's go i just want to go straight to the boss oh wow yeah that was like 500 experience just off of that i guess we do want to fight anyway i'm gonna speed this up um 
<laughs> when I run to Sakai. Okay, it's Sakai, take two. Also, I noticed I got the survivor track level one. Not even attempting, not even trying for it, but it's pretty sweet. All right, let me try and aggro just the ads like last time. It was pretty good. Come on, guys. Yeah. Oh, this is such an easy farm. I want my warriors to come over here, though. Bring them over here, guys. They don't want to. They don't want to get too far away from him, I guess. Get them come a little closer. There they go. That's better. One more archer. Yeah, see the AI is they they for some reason the AI AI prioritizes spirits. It's so weird. Come on. Okay. Alright, it's my turn. Oh, I should have used illusion of weakness again. I always forget that. Hack me. Okay. Wow, that was close. We're just going to spam ineptitude and empathy. This should do the trick. And then images of remorse is... Ah. I can spam it though. Channeling's nice here. Oh, can I not beat him? He's out healing. Ah. Should have let me move him to this spirit of pain. It might help. Oh okay. Yeah, there it goes. Ooh, that hurt. I don't understand. It heals so much. Alright, let's bring our teammates back, I guess. Oh no, am I gonna die? Need our teammates to lay down some spirits. Hmm, this one was harder for some reason. Fill me up. All right, so how can I do this differently? I'm just going to let my spirit henchmen lay down the spirits. And I should be able to finish them off. Come on, lay down the spirits. I'm not attacking. What the heck? There it goes. Okay, spirit one. There we go. Spirits are down. Let me try this again. This is like ultimate cheese mode, isn't it? Good. Should I run mind rack or something? I'm spamming. Oh no, that's hex skills. Never mind. Ah, oh, I keep mistiming images of remorse. Stupid healing signet. Alright, we got him, we got him. 
Spirit of Union still up. Got him. Okay. Ah, okay, take two's done. Let's do take three. It's a little bit of a long run than I expected, but we're getting that Lux infection. Okay, get the Lux and buff. Oh, they're already fighting. I'm just going to go up and around and just fight all of these guys. That Naga group's going to come no matter what. you like... Oh, and I forgot to change my build. Ugh. I mean, it's working either way. It'll just be slightly more efficient if we get that. If we replace Distortion with... Uh, Phantasm. Okay. Those piles of glittering dust are awesome like huge piles dust let's go ahead and aggro all these guys oh that knockdown was nice I feel like this is the run I think this is the run where we get both weapons. Okay, they're gonna fight. I'm gonna help the Lux or the Outcast because I don't want I don't want our boss to perish. I want him to stay alive. Where's he at? Okay, he's doing okay. Okay, he's not gonna out damage our healers. Get the ritualist. Now the archer. Okay. I get it. Oh, there's a death hand. What's he doing? Oh, the death hand is a necromancer? I thought the death hand was a assassin for some reason. Over there. There you go. Nice. He doesn't have a healing ability, so it's pretty very easy to farm him. I don't even really need a spirit. That minus three degeneration, it like doesn't do anything. He has some base health regeneration for some reason. Nothing. Dang it. Okay. Okay, take four, take three. I, I'm gonna stop saying the takes because I really, I honestly lost count. Yeah, something's doing some damage to me. Okay. 
make sure our monk has spirits back up. Buy them. Your spirits up. Your spirits out. Union. Okay. Who's the next one? Spain and Pain and Shadow, Shadow Song. Right. Got him. Got him right where we want him. He's in him. Okay, hurry up and get out of the range. Ah, oh, just gold. See, that time he gave me 125 faction. Man, whenever we farmed the the um, daggers, it dropped on the fourth try. This is going to take some time. Okay, let's try um, removing these, and then I'm going to grab um, not accumulated pain. Although that's not bad. Let's get Conjure Fat Phantasm. That's minus eight. That's minus eight the generation. That should be good to counter his healing signet. Perhaps. Oh wow, the Naga, when I just let them fight, the Naga really do a number on them. You could just wait, you could just wait until the Naga just engage them, and then it should be able to, I can solo all of them actually with this build, as long as they're grouped up. I need to take the warrior out. Actually, the warrior is going to be, or the, the boss is going to be easier than the archer. The archer just takes no damage. Go. And phantasm. Energy. Get channeling. Neptitude. And my teammates can start coming back now. And we get the shield. Boom. <laughs> uh, too good to be true. Got a ton of faction off of that one. Yeah, I don't think this is going to drop. I'm gonna try and get my spirits to come to fight this closer so I can use the spirits on them. Maybe I don't really need to play this so safely. Because he's hard to kill, so I think we can just take them all out like we normally do. Be faster that way. Yeah, just don't worry about it. Alright, take the archers out at first, I guess. I don't want any AoE on him. Got the spirits up. Okay. We should be able to solo him now. Go. 
get my energy up. Another ineptitude off. Please. Need Phantasm on him. Yeah, he takes no degeneration. Oh, this is not gonna work. Uh, come back. Yeah. Oh no. I get him. Oh, we got him. He got the drop. He got the drop. Yeah. Yes. Oh, nice. Oh, that was a little messy, but we got it. We got the sword. Heck yeah. Oh, this was awesome. Okay. Look at that. What's that? Look at that beauty. Look at that beauty. So, uh, max damage, of course. 15% damage above 50. Double adrenaline gain. Uh, adrenaline gain 10 10% uh, chance and then 30 health. That is a nice sword and it looks cool Most important thing is it looks really cool Ooh, That was tough. He almost killed us that time All right now we just need to farm this shield Just need to farm the shield. Ah, oh, that's so cool. All right, let's see how this works. We got the first, there we go. Got the first green, Sakai sword. Really beautiful. Um, and then we're gonna try and keep running this a little bit more to try and get Jeffers green. Pretty nice little farm. Just go talk to this guy, the priest. You get the Luxon blessing. This little group comes down here. Take him out clean. That's the group over there we're gonna take. He's already fighting the Kraken. And then there we go. Good, good, good. Take them out. All right, so that enemy goes down really fast. And then we want to pull this group down a little bit because there's a team of Naga that come down to fight them. No, no, no. Don't attack Jeffer. Go. I need to conserve my energy. These guys go down really fast. Just tell your henchmen to focus fire them. And then that works. There we go. I'm gonna put channeling on myself because that's gonna help give me some energy. All right, now it's Jeffers by himself. Zero stress, noob proof farming build. Okay, I thought he wasn't gonna attack there for a second. yes we got it oh nice oh we got both of them heck yes look at that it's so pretty jeffers bulwark the tactics shield the plus 10 piercing damage is not excellent but you know in certain situations it's pretty good like, you could use this for farming um, raptors, I believe. You need a piercing damage shield for that. Or piercing damage resistance shield for that. Um, yeah, it's cool. I mean, max, max green shield. Oh, it's the same skin as the one we're using. <laughs> I didn't realize that. That's funny. I shouldn't get them mixed up. 
Um, I don't have any space in my weapons pack. Let's hope I don't salvage it. But yeah, that's it. That's the the new proof farming method strikes again. We got a pretty healthy amount of Lux in faction. Look at that, 8,400. Still a ways away. Oh, we're still a lot of ways away. Like, what is that? 25,000 faction or so away. Yeah. I don't know if we're going to get it before um, finishing factions but, or before moving on. Okay, for sure, next episode, we're moving on. Uh, just, just, I'm sick of the Jade Sea. That's it. All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Go try the new proof farming method for yourself. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.